Let's do it. I gotta go to the bathroom though real quick. Let's get it open. Wait, what? What happened? Is there an update or something? Why did it just ask me to do that? Alright, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. Oh wait, uh, here. Uh, before I forget. scare the fuck out of me sometimes. They're everywhere. They are everywhere. Let's do a quick can check so you can see what I'm living in. Not near enough yet, but we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. I can only drink two a day if I don't want a heart attack, okay? I will die if I drink more than two. I'm already worried about my my b blood pressure going up from drinking two of these a day. I should honestly probably cut it down to one, if we're being real. It's 150 milligrams of caffeine per can, right? But when we're pulling these crazy streams, actually, I started drinking two. I used to only drink one, but I started drinking two when we started playing Dark and Darker. Oh, I got some mail. Let's see. Any of my shit sell? Let's see. It expired already. Fuck. Oh, but a couple of them sold. Okay, three gold there. My Mithril Blunderbusses sold. Two of them. I got two more to sell. Okay. Cool. Very cool. Um, and then these expired too. I thought I put them up for 24 hours, but all right, I'll, re I'll do that Okay So like I said, we have a huge grind ahead of us right now Actually, I'm gonna keep this uh, here. Let's do this Brian get the game up on the screen, please Thank you um, we're gonna keep rested XP over here for now, and I'm gonna open up questy for the first time in a while Because we're going a little off Off track. Yeah, we're doing tribe, but we're we're mainly just gonna do the quests that we have in this area now Which part of that is the tribal necklaces But We might farm them afterwards. I don't know. We'll see once we complete the quests how much more XP we have to go because Rested XP is telling me to get to 87,500 XP before it gives me my next steps. 
We're only at 25,000. We got a ways to go. It's going to be a long grind to 46, okay? We'll see. I might not just farm the, the trolls. I might, at, once we finish these quests, we might go find some other quests to do. I am worried that we're doing quests right now that Rested XP might have me do in the future, but part of me doesn't think so because it says Feral Ass is from 44 to 48. By the time I get 48, these quests would be like green to me in this area, if not gray. So yeah, all right, let's, uh, let's buff up. Let's make some water. Let's make some food. And then we'll make a mana gem here in a second. If I see anybody in Fangsley or only Fangs asking for Olderman, uh, Maradon, or ZF, we will we will do that. I'm a little scared about ZF. ZF is kind of sketchy. But we'll see. Or if they ask for any, like Scarlet, any, any, like only Fangs member, if they ask for anything and they need me, I'll go do it. But especially if I see people saying Oldman, Mara, or ZF. Oh, wait a minute. Let's see. Uh, we have, uh, did it work? Why don't I see my new... Does it not have a... An icon for the new thing? Unit scan? Does unit scan not have an icon? As long as it works. Alright, let's make a mana gem. And let's pull out our uh, new mount that uh, was... Uh, Paid for by uh, Ryan in the chat. Unit scan. Okay. Wait a minute. Does it give me like an alert, like high alert though? If not, I need to get high alert back. Like, will it pop something up on the screen? Encrypted, you you probably know. If it doesn't. Yeah, Encrypted's the one that's used it, so I'm just waiting for him. Because if not, I'm... I'm. It gives an alert? Okay, cool. Hopefully it's better than the high alert one. We got them out yesterday, Navius, because of Ryan. The the homie you sent over in the raid yesterday we were like uh like i forget how much gold we were away from it but he hooked me he was like offering to give me 15 gold and i was refusing i was like no way i can't do that and then he insisted and then gave me 25 gold are these the tr these are the trolls they're level 40 all right easy oh my god troll warrior right there Oh, people in the guild are saying Miz is about to break the curse. Damn, everybody's on right now. Level, oh shit, he gets level 44. Curse is broken. Opium. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Pesset riding a boat from Aberdeen. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. 
Oh, there's a lot of dead ones. I need to be careful. This guy is literally farming them right now, I think. I think that's what he's doing. I might need to ask for a lair. I might need to ask somebody for a lair off of seven. Damn, that 666 clinical damage. Insane. Okay, hold on. Um, I think I'm, I'm good for now. Actually, yeah, hold on. Let me, let me get to a safe spot. Let me go somewhere where I don't think they're going to spawn. And then, yeah, invite me. Oh, my God. Where's this place where I can layer safely? I'm probably over here. All right, right here. Thank you so much. Perfect. Thank you. Appreciate that. Wait, hold on. Wait. Thank you. Oh, I was about to type thank you in the fucking party chat. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, here we go. Damn, dude, I'm doing crazy clips tonight already. Oh, got one. You know what? We might farm these for a little bit. We'll go do the other quest too. Which actually, let me look at my map after this. Okay, so I need to check these cages in here. Those cages right there. Bro, I fucking hate range damage, man. At least it's not some a caster, but range damage is the fucking worst. There's just nothing I can do about it. Absolutely nothing that can be done. You know what? I'm gonna change some of my hotkeys. What do I have on six? Evocation, that makes sense. But seven and eight, I'm gonna change to fire ward and frost ward, and then nine and zero will be food and water. And actually, I might even do six and seven fire and frost ward, eight evocation. I think it's something to do. I don't think I'm pulling anything else by pulling this guy, right? It's just him? Yeah. I think that's it, right? There's nothing else next to him. You start getting hit by two of these, it's fucking... Could be Jover. Not really, though. They're only level 40, 41. I can't pass that yet. Ooh, nice, dude. Some blue booties. Is there another one right there? It's just this guy, right? fucked checking the cage I'm not gonna get attacked by anything by opening this right all right and then where is this other cage that I need to look for
Is that it? Or are those the only two cages I needed to do? I think so. Here, I don't even know what quest it is. Uh, what area? No, that's Feral Ass. Oh no, there is a third cage. Where's that third one at? Oh, right there. Yeah, we'll turn it. We'll do these quests. We'll go turn them in. We'll see how much more XP we need, which is probably going to be a lot. And then we'll determine whether we want to go do quests in another area, maybe. Or... Well, I don't know. We'll see. I'm actually going to change my hotkeys around right after I regain my mana. Oh, some spider silk boots. What are the stats on that? Oh. Do you have do you have all the mats? I sent you spider silk, didn't I? I sent you some. I think I sent you like 3, maybe 4. And then if you need some iridescent pearls, I sent you two. Okay, I got I got those too. I get something first. Oh, what's that? Oh, okay. Wild find potion. Nice. Oh, I also have this, that other one, right? Yeah, the invulnerability potion recipe. Oh, spider silk boots. Nice. Four salmon, four analog, seven spirit. That's good. All right, where am I going? Over this way. I already have three out of five. Farming these might not be a bad idea. God, I fucking hate melee, uh, ranged. Oh yeah, um, am I safe right here for a second? Okay, so action bar two. Seven and eight, I wanna switch to nine and zero. Evocation is gonna go to eight. And this is gonna be six and six. Okay. Yeah, there you go. You yeah, those will carry you a long way.
I wonder what's another place, though, if I don't feel like farming the troll necklaces where I can go do some quests that are around this level that rested XP isn't going to have me do. Yeah, for a quest that's yellow. But like I was saying, I don't know if I want to just farm the necklaces. But we got to get to 87,000 XP somehow. That's why I was saying, like, instead of doing this, I w what other areas can I go quest in? I'm getting 424 XP right now per kill. That'll probably change once my rested is gone. Oops, I'm a little low on mana. Oh wait, that was dumb. I forgot that was ranged. That's fine. Oops, wrong button. Oh my god, resisted. Great. I need to get to 87,500. I'm at 32,000 right now. We're not talking about 8,700. Let's go to the other one. So which numbers are the ones that are important to you? Um, when I'm like, when I'm killing something here, next troll. I'll, sh I'll explain all the numbers that come up on the screen. Like, oh, I'm going the wrong way. Whenever you see numbers pop up on the screen when I'm killing something, every time I hit it, that's the damage that I'm doing. The smaller the number, the, like, the smaller the amount of damage when the number's big, that's like a crit damage. Critical. Like here. Oh, and these are yellow. So that's a 313 damage, 333 damage, 120 damage, 334, 329, oh don't pull that, 331, yeah you don't ever ask dumb questions Hellish, none of it's dumb. And then right at the end I forgot to point it out. But at the end, a little purple number comes up, and that's how much experience I got for killing it. Like, uh, yeah, like Encrypted just said. Six forty-five. That's a crit right there. 
And then the XP right there, 424. All right, we got all the necklaces that we need already. already have extra necklaces yeah you know it might be worth it but just sitting here killing these trolls for the next little bit is going to be boring as fuck hellish ask any question that comes to your mind i will never ever consider any of your questions dumb the only questions that are dumb are the ones that come from the bomb Give me that Mithra, I'm a dirty little mining slut. You know I need my dirty little ores right now. You know I need them. Where's this other cage we gotta open? Right there. Exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, there's no... No time I would ever be like, that's a dumb question, Hellish. Like, you what kind of person you think I am? You think I'm a mean guy? I'm a freaking nice guy. Unless it's the bomb, then I'm fucking not mean, but I'm I'm honest and I give him tough love. I can't really see what I'm fighting if I'm gonna be pulling anything extra right here. I don't think so. I think I'm just pulling this one. Hopefully I don't pull her too. If I do, I can deal with it. I'm not worried. Uh-oh. Did I just pull? Oh, it's a, even if I pull two, we're going to kill this guy so fucking quick. Okay, yeah. It was just her right there. Yeah, because not only does the bomb get tough love when he's in chat, he gets it when we're in bed after stream together, so. Different kind of tough love. More physical than mental, but. Well, Hellish, like, if you want to play WoW, you don't have to play Hardcore WoW. You could always just play Normal WoW, where, like, the stakes aren't as high. Or if you're interested in Hardcore WoW, you, you could literally throw your hat in the ring for that, too, you know? Now, question is, am I going to pull something else? Oh, there's a chest right there. What a waste of Frost Nova. I'm not sure which one you're talking about. And so wait, it gives, uh, creates that blue yellow XP bar on the screen. Okay, to, the way to tell if it's interactive or not, can you as a viewer like put your mouse over it and it like gives you information? Cause that's probably a Twitch interactive thing. I don't know though.
Is there somebody else in here? No. Give me this. Well, you know who's really good at figuring that out? You are, as well as Yurio. Yurio's really good at figuring out. I've Every time I've been like, what mod is this? One of you tells me. Yurio might know then. I don't I don't know which one you're talking about specifically though. LVI. I feel like that's not the first time you've mentioned that one, Yurio. I feel like I've heard you say that. Damn, we already have seven necklaces. All right, let's farm since we're done with this quest. Let's just farm three more necklaces so we can do two turn-ins and we'll see what kind of XP we get. So I think, yeah, we have seven, right? Or is it eight? Where are they? Oh, we have nine already? We have nine necklaces already. Samurai with the fritchin raid yo here. I think I can go. I think I can go uh, Log out right over here Hold on let me kill this real quick. Oh We got our other troll necklace. Yo, this is quick actually These ones that I'm getting right here these troll necklaces uh, uh, troll tribal necklace. You could go buy them on the auction house, but people like XQC have greatly uh, inflated the price. Oh, it's an offline raid, Samurai. Thank you so much for the offline raid. I appreciate that so much. But yeah, if you have enough of them, we watched a video where Mitch Jones. It's like you. Get, he went from level was it forty five or forty six to fifty in fifteen minutes. He just turns him in nonstop, and you just that bar just moves up. And I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to get to level 50 doing this. But I'm definitely going to use it to get to uh, 87,000 XP. Yeah, get it encrypted. Yurio, and if you have a hard time setting it up, I'm sure Yurio can answer your questions. Oh, damn. It's not even going to show me where the trolls are anymore. Let's get another five. That was so quick. But I think there was more trolls over here. It looked like there was a lot populated in this area, and they might be higher level. These ones were, like, green and yellow. Samurai, how are you doing, dude? Thank you again for the offline raid. Appreciate it. I always appreciate when you guys tell me if it's an offline raid or not. Because if it's an online raid, even of one view, we go crazy. With the offline raids. We used to do at the beginning of stream offline raid parties, though. Where everybody would come in with an offline raid and we'd fucking go hype. But we haven't done that in a while. But those offline raids really do help. It boosts you up in the algorithm to where you show up in, in people's recommended... Boost you in that algo.
Isn't there a way for me to have my XP bar just constantly tell me what XP I'm at? Like how my health constantly shows me the numbers? Is that, isn't that just in the normal WoW UI? Or do I have to get an add-on for that? It's in options? Here, let's do that real quick. Um, interface. All right, let's see. Not aggro percentage, uh, percentages. Wait. Oh, that's raid frames. Oh, it is, it is? Okay, it's a slash command, and you sent me a TikTok on how to do it? Okay, um... I think, here, let's kill this. What's the command? Just tell me. I'll just, instead of looking at the video, if you guys know what it is, just type it in chat. I'll type the command. Please and thank you. Oh, yeah. These are better. These trolls are even better for me to kill. Dude, we already have 11. I wonder if Mitch Jones farmed all of them in that one video we watched or if he had bought them from the, the auction house. They're so expensive, though. I mean, if you have gold or you're swiping that plastic for some gold, you could do it easily. Come on. Oh, this person might be doing it too. Did we just get another one? And Soda bought them from Auction House. Okay. Okay, so... Oh, that's what it is. All right. Thank you. Um, cons... Oops. Console XP bar text. That didn't work. What the fuck was it? Oh my god, I thought I was being attacked. Wait, who did that? Oh, well, you're too far away from me. I can't hit you with it. Put a one behind it. Okay. Base one. There we go, Pog. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. God, I feel it feels like I'm doing ZF right now. Is shadow locked? Or nature locked, you dumb bitch. Two hundred and fifty six damage, one lightning bolt. This one. One lightning bolt, dude.
Is there something up there? Some kind of elite or something like that? Yeah, there is. There is. Where? I'm so scared. That scared the fuck out of me. Jesus Christ. That is so much better. It has to be up there, right? That was fucking scary. Bro, that actually scared. So much better than high level alert, dude. So much better. High level alert almost got me killed. I, 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 you know, I like it, but it, it scared me in the same way that you guys scare me with the sound alerts. It's called unit scan. And make sure you get the hardcore one. I just got it before stream because Russell talked about it in the meeting. He said it was better than high level alert. So wait, let me just click around real quick. It has to be up here. It has to be up there. But let's, uh, we'll just take out these guys for now. That act. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Look. I got my blood pumping a little bit. Okay. Okay. Where is he? He has to be up there, right? A tick counter? Okay. Oh, I'm like out of mana. Yeah, it's like, like you're the alerts on an iPhone or on a TV. It's fucked up. Actually gave me a jump scare both times I'm assuming he's up there though like I don't see it anywhere else I think I'm fine down here, but still that thing going off non-stop is gonna be fucking annoying Oh, okay, the two second thing for mana regen, okay. But yeah, I don't see this anywhere. It has to be up there. We're not even gonna go up the steps. We'll, we'll get this guy and that's it. Oh, really? It can aggro him? Oh. Bro. Well, if I see anybody running down the fucking stairs, I'm out. Two hundred sixty-five damage, dude. Oh fuck! Damn it! I oh I couldn't have counterspelled it anyway. Bro, I'm. This is fucked. Three hundred damage right there, and he resisted that. Oh my god! Okay, I'm not fighting these things. Those did way too much damage. All right, let's go back to the other camp. Oh, I could have dampened magic on too. That's so wild. Five second rule. Okay. Is that that's another one like unit scan or high level alert? I like this one now. Like I said, the other day when I was doing that quest in Arthai Highlands, and I was walking what I thought toward what I thought was just like a normal horde base for questing. I didn't know it was an actual like faction base. That it was just a base with a bunch of orc NPCs. Maybe or trolls, or I didn't even know what it would be there. I like stopped, opened my map, and when I took my map out I saw the high level alert come up and there were like five to ten orcs running at me all skull level I, I wish I would have had high level alerts it would have told me way before I bet
All right, we're already at 40,000 XP. And how many necklaces do we have? 11. I think so. I know about the five second rule, like IRL, but I'm pretty sure he's talking about an add on. scare me I'm almost out of man I don't know about this guy I can use evocation though oh yeah fuck this I'll manage him So Poke asked if any Fangsley want to do dead mines. He's talking about people that are like closer to his level, right? Like he wouldn't want a level 45 to come do dead mines with him, right? Because then he's gonna get no XP for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit him up. Cause he's uh he's I think he's working on his alt. But like I said, I'm pretty sure he's talking about people that are his level, right? Maybe a little bit higher. Uh, okay, I'm not getting any of the, the necklaces over here. I'm, I'm assuming these trolls drop them. I don't know. I think you can. What, what level is Shadow Fan keep? I'd want a healer. It, I no. I want a healer there. If we're going, if I'm going into any dungeon, I need a healer. I don't care what level the mobs are. And honestly, somebody that's gonna tank. I, yeah, but you're not. You're level twenty something. You're not gonna be able to heal me that well, right? What, what's your heal do? How much, how much health? Okay, these things do drop the necklaces. All right. Leave me alone, you wolf. Watch the 26 solo. I ain't that. I ain't that guy. I'm not that guy. That ain't me, bro. I ain't even out here trying to mob tag, okay, by myself. 
even though I'm a mage and could do it, I'm not. I'm good. Okay, I'm gonna put these on my bar. Oh, you can't. Damn it. Let's make some more food and water. Make another mana gem. Oh, there we go, Ryan. Charles the Boar, let's go. I love that. I love that. Oh, so you have a level 34 hunter too, along with your warlock, that's cool. watch another rav video today will we that's okay we watched so much of the only fangs meeting that we'll we'll continue with the rav series tomorrow or well monday since sunday i take off Locks your man, yeah. I was a. That's what I. When I first started playing WoW, back in like 2006, that was like my main class. And even when I came back to it during Shadowlands, because like I said, I played like vanilla WoW when it first came out, a couple months into Burning Crusade, and then I took a break and for 15 years, and then played for Shadowlands. When I was a lock then. Affliction Warlock. And then, uh, Shadowlands 9.1 patch happened, and they said, Oh, Affliction Warlocks get fucked. Your single target damage ability, Mal Malphic Rapture, nerfed into the ground. And they said, Oh, and that legendary that you grinded for in 9.0? Sorry. We're deleting that legendary. You have to go grind for a new one. And I said, I quit. Like, everybody that did Affliction Warlock PvP in retail was like, it's over. Like, you have to be Destruction Warlock now, and I did not want to have a four-second Chaos Bolt cast. It was so boring. It was so fun. Like, the rotation was just so boring compared to a Affliction Warlock. Affliction Warlock, I was, like, running around, jumping, casting all my dots... Malphic Rapture spamming after you get all your dots on. And once you got all your dots on and you spam that Malphic Rapture, it was like a three shot. You, the people were dead. It was so sick. I loved it. Dude, PvP was so much fun. I was going to hit Gladiator, but then they reached the season. Re I didn't start grinding Arena until like the last like two weeks of the season. And uh, just ran out of time. And then they deleted it. I was like, never mind. I made a Demon Hunter, got it to level 60. I enjoyed Demon Hunter. It's a fun class in retail. Really fun. Priest, Cleric, Mage, yeah, yeah. Wait, what's a White Mage? What is that? Oh, I'm fuck. I'm like out of... Mana. My mana is low. Oh shit. <laughs> Fuck that. Oh shit. I'm out. I'm not fighting this wolf. We're out. We'll go back and loot that in a second.
I think I'm good. At least bandage real quick. Owies! Go away! Go away! There we go. Uh... No, so my, up here at the top, right underneath my health is my mana. And that's like, I run out of mana if you, uh, like, that's why after every couple fights, I sit down and I drink my water that I make for myself as a mage and I regain my mana. But each, each ability takes up mana. Um, but as a mage, your main rotation when fighting normal mobs is just Frostbolt. Which is like your main damage ability. And then I use this thing called Frost Nova when they get close to me, which freezes them in place. Um, I use this thing called Blink. Like once Frost, because every time I use Frost Nova, there's a cooldown before I can use it again. So if that, that breaks and they get close to me again, then I can blink away from them. Like teleports me a certain distance ahead of or where I'm looking. Um, and that's the main rotation you use, but there's a couple other things like if uh, they get close to me And I don't feel like using another sh frost bolt. I just hit him with fire blast real quick when it's like the last hit um, There's a thing I have called polymorph which turns them into a sheep which I use if I'm going up against like two mobs at a time I'll usually sheep one Oh, it's a healer in Final Fantasy XIV. Okay. Yeah, man is my main thing. Other than yeah, other than my health, man is the main thing. But as a mage, unless you're if you're fighting something with range damage, like these guys that throw axes or people that are casters, I can usually fight things without them even hitting me because of my Frost Nova and my Blink ability. But when they throw axes like this, I could keep like blinking out of the way and moving out of their distance to where they have to run closer to me but you're always going to get hit but if it's a melee mob I can just kite it usually without taking any damage it's resisting my shit okay Oh, and then like right here, this is a caster. I have an ability called Counterspell. Where I stop it from being able to use its spell on me for a certain amount of time. Dude, they keep resisting my shit. Ice Barrier, that's uh the next thing I'm gonna be getting. But I want to put one more point into Winner's Chill first, then I'm going to get that. And I actually, I need to put another point into uh, Frost Channeling too, but I'm, I'll get Ice Barrier first. I'm going to do Winner's Chill, then Ice Barrier. And then, so yeah, Counter Spell. For 10 seconds, they can't cast. God damn it, I hate when I do that. I waste my Frost Nova. So another thing, because of my talents, Hellish, I have a chance to freeze them just by using one of my spells. Like that, I, I, they got frozen just by me hitting them with my Frost Bolt. But if that doesn't work, then once they get close, I use the other thing, Frost Nova, which freezes them in place. But sometimes, I'll cast Frost Nova right at the same time as they get like frozen by one of my spells, so it's just... I always fucking do that. But yeah, Ice Barrier is great. I need to get that. What am I... What, I'm going to put that on Alt, I think. I think that's going to be my Alt hotkey. Yeah, I should, honestly. That's probably one of the safest things I could get for staying alive. Maybe I'll, I will get that once I hit level 46. Yeah. 
How many do we have now? Where is it? I don't even see him in here. Oh, 15. All right. Let's get five more. We'll, we'll have three turn-ins. Or well, it'll be four, in, like, including the first one. So, wait. I'm going to ask... Sorry about that. That's exactly why your mom loves me, Hi, Sinero. That's exactly why. Your mom loves my ball sack. She loves it when I'm like smacking it up against her face. She loves it. Yeah, you're, uh, some people are just miserable, you know? Some people are just miserable. It's all good, I don't mind. It doesn't bother me at all. Like, the level of miserable you have to be to try to say something to make somebody else, like, feel bad, it's like, says a lot about you and nothing about the person you're trying to make feel bad. But I don't care. You look like a ball sack. Oh my god. My feelings are so hurt. See you right there. I used my Frost Nova at the same time he got frozen by one of my random freezes. Yeah, must suck to suck. It's okay. We'll let him keep sucking. Ooh, so wait, are we at 18 now? Two more? more and we'll go turn him in and we'll see what happens and we're already at 50,000 XP so this isn't that long of a grind like I thought it was gonna be this isn't that bad Thank you. 
resisted great. Love it when that happens. Oh shit. Uh, all my buffs are gone already? What the fuck? Isn't Feralas where that other quest is that Miz died on? The the es the little like chicken escort quest? Political. One more, I think. Go turn these in. Okay, for sure. Okay, other than dumb row, okay. Let's see if this gets me up there. If not, we're just going to keep doing this. We'll just go grind some more. But I think we'll get close, actually. If not there. Love this song. It's a good one. Here there, off with you. Watch your back. Be good. Off with you. Watch your back. Be good. Okay, and then we have one more to go turn in. 
But that didn't get us up that high. <laughs> not, not even anywhere near what I thought it would. But you have enough of those things, you could level up very quickly. The other quest that guy has available is all like orange mobs, I think. So I'm not gonna take that one. Break the media. Isn't that... I'm not checking up there. Or well, I don't know, maybe we could just check it real quick. Be good. We're gonna go back over there. Maybe we could just check the top of it real quick. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll just check it, maybe. We'll see what's up. Yeah, we're only at 59,000 now. Fuck, dude. It's alright. We'll just go do that some more. We'll kill those trolls. Be there soon. Actually, might as well just take that quest. Maybe we can do it, but it's an orange quest, so I doubt I'll be able to, but I don't know. Maybe we can fight the mobs. Maybe we can do it. We'll go check those out. There's a quest where you have to get those to land, I think, right? Wasn't that one of the quests? That might be somewhere else. What place is this? Yeah, let's go see. I don't think I'm going to be able to fight these things. Maybe, though. Even if they're orange, I might be able to.
Wait, is that... Where is that? Where's the horde base? Is this it? Oh, I can fight these things. Level 47. I got this. How is that out of range? Yeah, let's do this quest. Hopefully the drop rate's not too bad, but even if it is, it doesn't matter. I, oh, I know you can't fight on your mount, but it'll just dismount you once you start to attack, but I was just surprised at that little range that I have. I swear sometimes there's things that I shoot from a way further distance than that. I might have to gr grab some food here in a minute. I might have to go get a snack. Okay, so there is like a level 48. That's okay. I can just kill the lower level ones, right? These, Yeah, they drop what I need. Okay. I need to get closer. See, look at how far away I am from this thing, dude. It's too far away. You know what? I want to listen to that one album again. This right here. This shit bucks. Post rock, Midwest, emo, math rock goodness. Better XP for the trolls. Yeah, yeah, but I'm just gonna do this quest real quick. Ooh, what's that? I'll get some good XP from this quest, then we'll go back, then we'll do the trolls for the last little bit. Oh yeah, and this one isn't even a full drop rate quest. Wait, is it? Yeah, I'm getting them just for killing them. Yeah, I have to collect the Jade Ooze, but also, I guess I, yeah, just killing these. Okay, cool. I thought it said green sludge, but it's green sludges. Easy. 
But who drops the Jade Ooze? But no, I've already gotten one, so they're not all level 48. Let's try to kill that level 48. It'll be easy. We got this. I need more mana. Oh shit. Why is he resisting? I might put high alert back on because high alert would usually alert me of this this I feel like wouldn't it or no is that because it's orange let's see Okay, the first shot was not out of range, but then the second one was. Got it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Easy. But we didn't get the ooze from... Oh, wait, no. So we just have to kill them. All right, easy. This is an easy one. And since it's an orange quest, we'll get some good XP for it. God, dude, these rifts are so fucking good. I'm gonna turn it down. It got a little loud. Where'd that other one go? That guy, there was another one that was around here. Have your boots in one hour. Did you already get them? Because I just saw you linked it to me. Did you get them in less than an hour? Oh, mail him. That's right. Oh shit, you know what? Here, I'm gonna let this thing de-aggro because this thing's on the way. Oh fuck.
Uh-oh, line of sight? No, that's not line of sight. However, a little pole will create line of sight sometimes. Okay, some mana potions, let's go. Oops, I did not mean to stand up. Okay, let's just do this. Yeah, you probably could have farmed it, but I mean, it just depends on what you want to do. If you have the gold, just buy that shit, you know? Um, I watched a lot of Nickelodeon and uh, Cartoon Network, but mainly when it came to Cartoon Network, I watched Adult Swim. But uh, on Nickelodeon, I watched a lot of Hey Arnold, Doug... Ren and Stimpy, Rocco's Modern Life, Ah Real Monsters, Cat Dog, did I say Angry Beavers? Um, but Rocco's Modern Life and Ren and Stimpy being some of my favorites that were the most impactful on the person that I became. Two shows that got taken off the air because they were a little too, too mature. And then also Doug and Hey Arnold. Those shows were like my favorite. I like Adventure Time as well. That's like probably one of my favorite newer like cartoons. I, I think Adventure Time is a really good one. I never watched a uh, regular show though. Loved all those. Yeah, those were, ones were great. And then, yeah, yeah, in-game currency. Yeah, yeah. You can buy it. It's not allowed, but there's websites that sell in-game gold. And if you get caught, you'll get banned, but it's very unlikely you'll get caught unless you buy a bunch of it. But even then, you might not get caught. But I am very proud to say I have never bought myself gold in World of Warcraft before. But I don't look down on anybody that does. Yeah, Adventure Time is actually really good. Cool. I actually on my Amazon wish list I have uh, a Finn uh, plushie. It's like huge too. I want to get it and like fight with it on stream, like how I do with my puppets. And there's a BMO one. Dude, he's resisting all my shit. Wait, was Soda Poppin' actually buying it? I didn't know that. Yeah, basically. That, okay, so when I made that puppet, I made that puppet, it was my senior year of high school. I went to a, a magnet high school where you had to apply to go there and you went for like some kind of a major. It was a, a magnet school of the arts. You could go for theater, technical theater, music, dance, art, uh, a couple others. And I was a technical theater and music major. I, I was a double major. And my last like month of senior year, we didn't have any like production we were doing. It was just the, the last little bit of our, our high school experience. And our teacher was like, all right, we don't have any plays that we're working on. He's like, let's just do something fun the last month. And we like learned how to make puppets. 
and we had to like do like a puppet show with them. So I made that guy and I made him, uh, it wasn't Elmo at first, but he started to look like Elmo. He was supposed to be like a gnome, but cause he was red, he looked like Elmo, just like a beard and a hat. And he has this like little pouch that I like said had drugs in it. And actually there, there were times where I hid my weed in that. But uh, my puppet show was all about Elmo's E! True Hollywood story and he would constantly like, grab like coke out of his bag and like chop it up on the table and do lines. But uh... But yeah, that's one of my puppets. I have two others too. Um, bot farming, yeah, that'd be cool if they could get rid of that. Uh, no wishbone dragon tails. I did watch the magic school bus. I don't know. I never watched dragon tails I know about it, but I don't know about wishbone though But my other puppet is right here It used to have like this purple it was like really fluffy hair, but it, it's gone now Oh wishbone I remember that What's yeah, 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 yeah. I never watched it, but I remember hearing that. Oh, I don't need to kill any more of these ones. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wrong button. Yeah, PBS was great. I like I said, I watched Magic School Bus. Was Reading Rainbow on PBS too? Because I watched Reading Rainbow. Was she on Nickelodeon? Was that pre or post her talking about sucking that one dude's wiener in the movie theater? <laughs> the one dude from Full House. I mean, there's a song. Hey, it's it's on Jagged Little Pill. Great album. Lannis Moore says goaded. But I still, I wonder, like, why somebody as hot as her was dating that dude from Full House. Uncle Joey, yeah. Why did she care so much about him? Okay, so that was before Jagged Little Pill, okay. I need Amazing World of Gumball. Yeah, I never, I never, I've never even heard of that, I don't think. You ought to know, yeah, great song. That whole album, Jagged Little Pill, fucking great album. <laughs> Who's Dave Cooley? Who's that? I have no idea.
But yeah, no, Thrasher, there's a song by Alanis Morissette where she talks about... Uh, the whole album is about, like, her ex-boyfriend. And there's a song where she talks about how she went down on him in a movie theater. And it's Uncle Joey from Full House. I wonder if she still likes that line, because honestly, me, if I wrote something like that, like, years later, I might be like, I was cringe for writing that. <laughs> Heartbreak songs are always great, but that's just was always like, oh, okay. <laughs> Living large. Yeah, well, no, a Blumpkin is getting a blowjob while you're taking a shit. That's different. That's different. Oh, Uncle Joey is... Oh, okay. Dave, cool. Okay. He was on a show on Nickelodeon? Okay. So yeah, still amazing. I love that album. That lyric just always makes me laugh. One more of these guys and we're done. Let me up. God, this shit is so good. What the hell? Where'd you come from? Made a yeah, and then they did the whole Nick Jr. thing. I never really watched Nick Jr. But I was always a fan of Nick at Night, too. Like, at you know, the same time I was watching Nickelodeon, I used to watch Nick at Night, where I was watching Fresh Prince, uh, George Lopez, um, unfortunately, The Cosby Show. Hey, dude. I don't remember that one. But I remember, like, some of their old, like, game shows, like Legends of the Hidden Temple. Classic. Yep. Reruns for 60s and 70s, yep. Oh, shit. I kill this thing before the other thing makes it? I don't think so. Maybe. Oh no. Oh no! Time to jet. Time to get the fuck out of here. Come on, Diagro. So I can get that other guy. Come on. Come on. There we go. Fun house. No, uh uh. I don't remember that one. I remember full house. But yeah, I don't, not fun house.
Yeah, I've never even heard of it. What the hell? How did I aggro him? Another one, bro? Oh, this one will be easier. It's level 47. Almost out of mana, though. Oh, my God. He resisted. You know what? Let's do this. And then do that also. Just wait. Okay, we're on off cooldown. Yeah, the slime shit was always wild to me. Wasn't it every kid's dream at some point who watched Nickelodeon to like get slimed? I was down. I wanted to be on a show and get slimed. And then I remember like way later when I was already like in my teenage years or maybe even like young adult when they like slimed Katy Perry and they like literally like blasted her in the face. It was like what? They like f almost like fucked her up. Okay, we're almost there. We're at 67,000. 20,000 more XP to go. Oh, my bad. I forgot to see the enchant you did. Plus 16 armor. Nice, bro. My bad. I read that, but I forgot. On your boots. Very cool. Guys, guards, help me. Attack them. People in the guild are telling Wake to wake up. I wonder if he's like falling asleep while mob tagging. Sketch. Live action. Oh, what was that one show? What was that one show on Nickelodeon? Where they had like real live action, like little action figures. They were superheroes. What was that? And then Power Rangers. I liked that a lot when I was growing up. All right, 71,000. All right, let's go farm some trolls. Doctor Who, okay, yeah. Star Trek, uh, I never really watched Star Trek. But when it comes to uh, if I like Star Wars or Star Trek more, it's always Star Trek because they're based ass fucking socialists instead of that imperialist, colonialist ass Star Wars. Yeah, Action League, dude. Good shit. All right, I'll be right back.
Okay. Let's go farm some more trolls, I guess. We got like no XP for those quests, dude. Oh, but we do have that other quest to go see what's at the top of that thing. But it's orange, so we'll, even if we get attacked by the elite guy, we'll get away. Won't be bad. And you know what? If we can... Ooh, okay. Yeah, we got this. We freaking got this. If we can, hopefully we can run up those stairs with our mount on, and then we'll be able to just get the fuck away. He-Man and Masters of the Universe. I never watched those. I know He-Man, though. Yeah, I, like I said, I've never watched any Star Trek. I just know about the lore. Cyberman scared you. I, I'm trying to think, though, what other live-action stuff I watched. But yeah, Science, yeah, yeah, uh, Thrasher just started asking me about my old favorite cartoons and things like that. But I don't have a lot of live action stuff come to mind. I liked some Star Wars stuff. I just, I don't know. It wasn't ever something that I was like, oh my God, Star Wars is so amazing. I liked the ones that came out in the early 2000s better than the originals. Power Rangers Samurai. Yeah, I watched like the original Power Rangers. Danger Mouse. Isn't Danger Mouse, isn't that like a DJ? Too, I've never heard of the show. Oh, you know, another one was Rocket Power, just like a normal uh, animated cartoon. Rocket Power was dope. All right, let's just clear everything out and we're gonna work our way up there. I should put on that in a minute. Dampen magic. Yeah, Rocco's Modern Life was the one I said first. I said Rocco's Modern Life and Ren and Stimpy were my favorites. I remember the Inspector Gadget cartoon. I remember that. Rugrats. That, I forgot to mention that, but yeah, I watched Rugrats from like the very first episodes. And I had my little brother, like my, my, my parents had my little brother when around the same time that the movie came out where Dill was born. So I always loved that show. Dinosaurs, that was the one with the baby dinosaur, right? With the big ass eyes. Yeah, I remember that. British, yeah, BBC, yeah, yeah. Yep, they got hit with the asteroid, right? Yep. <laughs> yep. With the meteor, yep. I mean, you didn't see it, but yeah, they, that's how it was. What up, Apollo? Yeah, dinosaurs. Not enough mana. Oh shit, I'm out of mana. Oh my god, why are they all resisting my shit?
Did Adventure Time end? I thought, oh yeah, I, I guess it did. I never watched like Adventure Time from like the first episode to the end, but I've seen episodes and it's like out of all like new cartoons. And Adventure Time came out like deep in my like late teenage years, if not young adulthood. But I always liked that one. Compared to something like Rick and Morty, like I fuck with Adventure Time heavy. Whereas Rick and Morty started off cool to me, and then I just stopped liking Rick and Morty. I felt like it was like written by like two like very depressed dudes who are like like writing their depression into the characters. I was just like, this show's kind of weird. Oh my god, that scared me. Okay, so I gotta be careful. I gotta really be careful here. Courage the Cowardly Dog, I remember that. I didn't really watch it too much. Yeah, I never watched regular show either. Where on Earth is Carmen San Diego? I don't think I ever watched that. I've heard of it. Okay, so I gotta be careful that I don't pull stuff. Like if I pulled the Elite when I start killing on the stairs, then I gotta be careful. Come Slayer is uh, Stormfall. Such a good name. I randomly grouped with her one day before she was in OnlyFangs. Oh shit. I gotta be careful here, big time. Oh shit, dude. Fuck off, you stupid ass wolf. I'm gonna run out of mana. Fucked. Oof, strong button. Only fangs. Yeah, only fangs is the like the streamer guild in uh, Hardcore WoW. I'm in the uh, the sister guild called Fangsly. This is coming San Diego is a game too? Okay. Get fucked, loser. The person I just killed in game, none of you in chat. Uh. Alright, so we're gonna kill this guy, and hopefully we can use our our mount. So we're gonna ride up there and see what's at the top to complete this quest and we're gonna get the fuck out of there. Fraggle Rock? Yeah, I remember that show. Okay, let's see. Hopefully I don't pull it. Alright, 
We've got a tribal necklace. Let's go. All right, let's uh, get some mana back, and then we're going to go up here real quick and uh, get the fuck away. Oh, wait. Does it want me to actually, like... Hopefully, I don't have to search anything. Oh, do I actually have to, like, click on something up here? I might have to. If that's the case, we're not doing it. Oh no, fuck this, dude. Fuck that. Not worth it. Not worth it. Alright, we're just gonna kill. We're almost there anyway. Right here, let's see real quick. Let's just go up as far as we can on our mount and just see. Nope, not even worth it. Not even gonna risk that one. Not worth it. Damn, we'd get so much XP though if we just like run up there, but nah. Nah, we'll just, we're almost there. We're almost to the point to where we can carry on. There's like a high level elite up there and a bunch of like normal mobs around it. My quest is just to search and see what's up there, but not gonna risk it. I'm good. Chilling on that. We'll just kill these things, keep collecting their necklaces. We get XP from killing them, and we get XP when we turn in like five necklaces at a time, so we'll just keep doing that. How many nexuses do we have already? Five. We literally have five already. So. That album that we were listening to is over. I kind of want to listen to that feeble little horse album. That shit's really good. Might be a little loud. So good. Oh, here I'll uh, I'll post that in the uh, the album. I forget what they're called. It's I think it's Hobata. Hold on, it's in the the Discord under the music section. Mixable posted it. Um, it's they're called Hito Tara. Or no, Hito Hira. Sorry. It's this album right here.
fuck. I am so excited to get to 87,000. We got 10,000 more XP to go. Oh no. Didn't realize that. Uh. Ooh, anybody remember Street Sharks? I like that show. I actually uh, was one for Halloween one year. My grandma made the costume too. It was so sick. I've always wondered like where that costume went to the the helmet that she made the shark head was so good Oh my god, dude. Bro, he's just resisting all my shit. I'm, I'm fucking running away from this one. Dude, so much fucking damage. That is crazy how much damage they do, bro. Fizz? I've never even heard of that. I have no idea what that is. That might be just a down under thing. Samurai Pizza Cats? That was a teenage there was a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles ripoff? That's hilarious. Never heard about that one. We might have it here, but it's not something that's like popular. I've never even heard that before. Oh, like an ice cream? A sherbet ice cream? Okay. I'm not a big fan of sherbet that much. When I want ice cream, I want some like milk, vanilla, chocolate, something like that. didn't even go off the last one and I, I still took damage for it. What the fuck? I'm having some ping issues right now? I literally killed it before its cast went off and it hit me with the damage. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't even know what the fuck that is. Yeah, anytime I hear sherbet, I think of like that fruit ice cream. Like orange sherbet. Okay, is that paying issues? Because that's weird. Latency. How many do I have? Nine. Alright, yeah, we'll get 15. Best thing from Canada, ketchup chips. Ketchup chips are goaded.
I never had spicy mustard Doritos. No. Never tried that, but my best friend uh, was from Canada. I literally met him like an hour after he moved from Canada down the street from me. He was riding his bike around. I was like, oh man, what's your name? Where are you from? He's like, Canada. I was like, when did you move here? An hour ago. And uh, anytime he would go up there, he would always bring me back some uh, ketchup chips. So friendly. Humbleness is in their blood as Canadians. What up, Kel? Horse. See, I, you know, that's one thing. I fucking hate horseradish. I hate that shit. Ketchup. It's Lay's potato chips just with ketchup flavor. Best uh, Lay's uh, flavor, though, is uh, sour cream and onion. No question. No question about it. Oh, we have a ketchup hater in the chat? I don't know about that. I don't know about that one. Sour cream and cheddar is very close second. I fucking hate Fritos, though. I hate Fritos. Not a fan. The only Fritos I like are those, like, barbecue twist ones. I can fuck with those. Smell like dog toes? Do is like, Fritos? I don't know. I just... The flavor. I, I never liked the flavor of just the chip itself. Yeah, the honey mustard twist. That's what they are. Those are good. But uh, I think my favorite chip of all time is uh, Ruffle Sour Cream and Cheddar. If that's what you mean, Cal, by the Cheddar Ripples. Is that what you mean? Or I don't know. Maybe you mean something else. I think my favorite chip of all time, yeah. Ruffle Sour Cream and Cheddar, dude. Those are... It, like... Every single chip has flavor to it. Whereas I've talked about it the before, Doritos, you want them to be good, but Doritos are just a bag of fucking copium. You constantly have to like turn that shit upside down and be like, all right, let me shake all the seasoning that's like at the bottom to some of the chips because some of these chips have like no seasoning on them. <laughs> these are like bare ass chips, dude. Except for the, the cheddar ones, but even those, like, sometimes, like, the seasoning is just, like, it's like a bare-ass fucking chip. Those, fl I had those Flaming Hot ones, Yurio. They were good, but I swear that fucked up my stomach for, like, a week. And it wasn't even, like, like, diarrhea or anything. It's just, like, I had this, like, pain in my stomach for, like, a week after that. Yeah, exactly, Kel. You know, it's like with Doritos, you just constantly have to turn the bag upside down and shake that shit. But the only one that's ever not been like that with Doritos is the the purple bag, the uh, sweet chili. Those you, like every single time like have flavor. But yeah, that's we did a chip tier list once, and that's why I put Doritos like very low, just because it's just like a bag of copium. Anytime you get like those cool ranch or anything like that, it's just always just bare ass chips seasoning all at the bottom of the bag. Sea salt and black pepper, those are good. I love salt and vinegar flavor chips too. All right, we have 11 necklaces. We're at 79,000 XP. We'll get a couple more necklaces. We'll turn them in at, at 15, and we'll see. We'll see if we have enough. Spicy nacho Doritos. I haven't had those in forever. Uh, 
Oh shit. I also like those kettle jalapeno flavored chips. Those are really good. Or jalapeno. Oh my god, they do so much fucking damage. This is bullshit. Holy shit. And then again, dude, it didn't even complete the spell, bro, and I got hit with the damage. I, I kind of agree with that. What's the difference between Doritos and Fritos? I kind of agree with that. I mean, I can see that with the salt and vinegar. I've never noticed it, but I could see that happening if you eat too many. But I like them a lot. I can see that drying out the mouth real quick. But yeah, I just deleted a whole bag of sour cream and cheddar ruffles the other day. There's something weird going on in the guild chat. There's a guy in the guild chat that keeps typing egg. And now uh, Gamby, one of the like guild high ups in the guild is like saying he's making him f feel weird and sus. What's going on right now? Who is this Jimmy person? Are they a high up? Oh, it's a low. Oh, they're probably just fucking around. That's a level 60 paladin. They're just fucking around, I bet. Flaming hot pretzels. Interesting. I've never had that. When it comes to flaming hot Cheetos, I usually get the lime, the lime ones. Carolina Reaper. Yeah, see, I just, I like spicy things, but I'm not trying to, like, I'm not boonie, okay? I'm not boonie in the chat. I'm not a masochist when it comes to eating spicy food. All right, we're at 80,000 XP. We need 7,000 more. I have a feeling once we get, what do we need? Three more of these necklaces will be all good. Okay, music, uh, let's change. Let's listen to this again, I love this album. This is my friend's band from Portland. Some of you, we've listened to this a lot recently, but I love it. What the fuck, Hellish? That's wild. You need to feel the burn. Yeah, you too, Cal. You're so you're like Booney. Then okay, yep. I remember you guys have the same birthday. Yep. Yep. I love spicy stuff, but when I'm eating chips, like I don't know. I don't want it to be that crazy. But say I go eat some Thai food or some Indian food, I'm I'm like prepared for that experience. 
when I get my my Thai curry, hit me with it. When I'm eating some chips, I think I'm good at hot Cheetos. Like I said, that flaming hot sour cream and cheddar ruffles, really good. I like the flavor was great, but it like fucked up my stomach. Like it hurt, and I kept burping like all week, and I like tasted it. I was scared it was gonna like like put a hole in my stomach or something. See, exactly. That's what I was worried. I was worried I had like an ulcer or something from that that bag of chips. I went a whole week on stream not even mentioning it. But I was like dying that whole week. Fried ice cream is goaded. There's this one uh, Mexican restaurant that I go to all the time. Where they have fried ice cream so good. Shit blood like a lady for weeks. Oh, I, you know, I did that for like three years. I had this hemorrhoid that wouldn't go away. I eventually, last year, had to have it surgically removed. I did a whole street, a whole month of my stream from my bedroom in my bed because I was bedridden for a month because the recovery was fucked up. Some of you are here for that. Move my computer into my room. I would literally go to the bathroom and it was just blood everywhere. Yep, that's when Hellish first came around, yep. Yeah. But yeah, I've never had a Ghost Pepper, I've never had a Carolina Reaper, I'm good. I've had Thai chilies. In high school we used to ditch and go to this Thai spot and we would have Thai chili competitions and that's probably like the spiciest thing I've ever had. Oh, fuck. Oh, the wolf didn't even aggro? What the? I was it? Were you here a month before that year? Oh, nice. Yeah. That was a very interesting month for stream. That was the hardest thing I've ever gone through. Like, physically. My doctor told me, the surgeon, like, beforehand... He's like, out of all the surgeries that I do, this is the roughest recovery, and it fucking was, dude. Breathing fucking hurt. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's rough. I had to have a colonoscopy, too, actually, just to make sure when I was bleeding that I wasn't, like, dying of cancer. but I didn't have to have one after the surgery. Yep, every time. Every fucking time I went poop, it was, oh God, that was the worst month of my life. And then TwitchCon was the next month. I, it was all of August that I recovered, then went to TwitchCon last year in San Diego wearing a diaper because I was leaking from my butt. I met Amaranth wearing a diaper. Bucky's is one of the best truck stops ever. And NMP, my other favorite streamer, um, he has dealt with leaky butt issues too. So when I met him, I talked to him about my leaky butt and got some advice from him. We had it for different reasons though. He had it for having a poor diet. I had it from a surgery, but still. We, we had a, a, a connection. Literally, yeah, literally talk to NMP about my leaky butt. Okay, two more necklaces and we should be good. But yeah, Bucky's, like you guys are talking about that. On tour, it was two places once you got to the south and the Midwest. It was Waffle House and Bucky's. 
the best spots for a touring band. Great food, good prices. Best spots. Bussies, no, Bucky's. Bucky's, B U C C. Basically, Bussies, though. Speaking of that, there's the other place, Come and Go, but that's just like a normal. A normal gas station. Oh, really? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. The cysts, yeah, yeah. I didn't know you could get that from diabetes. All right, one more necklace. I've never heard of a huddle house. The only other place I know that's kind of like that. There we go. We're good. We got the necklace. Um, was in Missouri. We went to a place called Have a Snack, which was like a smaller version of a Waffle House. It was like a same type of like breakfast food spot, but it was just like smaller and had, had no affiliation to Waffle House. But same idea. Oh, okay, the impurities built up in your system. Yeah, okay. Got it. Oh, nice. Nice you work there. There was one tour where we uh most of it was on the West Coast. And we ate at Denny's like every fucking night. And I had my my ex-girlfriend was with me on that tour. And she was on unemployment at the time. So every night I was getting myself this like avocado chicken sandwich. Eating good. And everybody else was just eating the uh, the like mozzarella stick sandwich, like the cheapest thing they could get. They all fucking hated me. Bro, this isn't even getting me close, bro. Fuck. Alright, gotta go do it again. That's like... Only 390 XP every time? Jesus Christ, Miss Jones had to have like thousands. What the fuck? Okay, that sounds like a fun spot after a game. More options. Damn. Waffle House was the place with like the... So many options. Dice, smothered, covered. All that stuff. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 
Kel, like I said, my my surgeon told me out of all the surgeries he does, the hemorrhoid one is the worst recovery. And it fucking sucked. It was bad. Alright, we just have 3,000 more experience to go. We're not even going to probably turn in another one of those necklace quests. But it's been nice ever since then going to the bathroom and not thinking, oh my god, am I dying of cancer? Leave me alone, wolf. Yeah, right, how bad could it be, yep. But see, that, that, that was the good thing about the hemorrhoid that I have is it never hurt. It never hurt. It just, I would like go to the bathroom and then I would go to clean up and I'd be like what the oh yeah just looked like you had like some like red food dye and you just spilled the whole thing but it never hurt luckily what it did do though is it gave me irritable bowel syndrome for years I had IBS where my lower bowels would just hurt all the fucking time and the moment that I got done with the surgery and I woke up I didn't feel that pain anymore I knew it had to have been because that thing was like so huge. It was just like pushing up against my my insides and causing me to have that kind of pain. But I never had any like other kind of like hemorrhoid pain from it. It was just like my lower intestines, like my the lowest part of my stomach was always just like upset. From the moment I got done with the surgery, that it was gone. I haven't had IBS since. External, yeah, mine was internal, yeah, yeah. Fried steak with gravy at what? Ooh, yeah. Oh, you can't get one. I saw a bug fly in front of me. What the hell? I'm getting out of here. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Was not ready for that fight. Didn't realize my mana was so low. How did he cast that other one? Oh, he canceled it. Okay. All right. Let's re uh, re prepare for that. Almost there, 85,000. Gotta get to 87,500. We're almost there. Ooh, that sounds good.
Oh, somebody in the guild chat just said, can't wait for Hardcore uh, Burning Crusade. I wonder if they're going to do that. Blood Elf Life back, yeah. I mean, I'll go whatever, whatever Soda and all them are doing, I'll do. But I, you know me, I'd prefer to be on board. knew how to make an omelet without fucking him up that's why are you a cook why would you be a cook then oh my god that scared me again dude Six thousand, almost there, guys. A couple more kills, we'll be there. Well, that—that's for a normal person that's just cooking for themselves or whatever. That's normal. But if you go get a job as a cook at a place that cooks breakfast, how do you not know how to do an omelet? That's wild. Why is he resisting all my shit? Alright, fuck that one. Yeah, I just, yeah. I, that's wild to me. Oh no, the fucking, the wolf. God damn it. That's still the charging. Go away, wolf. Thousand more XP. Almost there. Oh, that's interesting. 
That's a way to funnel gold. That's true. Good point. Bro, they all resist my fire spells. How many necklaces I got? Two. Oh my god, this thing again. Bro, this wolf won't leave me alone. This wolf just won't leave me alone. Ouch, dude. Away, wolf. All right, couple more. Probably like three more mobs. Two more. Come on. Alright, one more. We're finally done with this dumb 87,500 grind. Get back to questing. gonna be it there we go how many uh let's get one more let's just get one more necklace why not we're here let's get one more fucking necklace and turn it in just need one more get a little extra XP why not Yeah, 600. Yeah, well, yeah, let's just do that. That's what my stream's gonna be, just farming these necklaces. Fuck that. No, thank you. This has already been boring enough for me. Just killing the same thing over and over. There we go. We're good. Got it. I respect the fuck out of that, Yurio, and I'm glad you enjoy it, but I do not want to sit here and kill the same mob over and over. I do not. Let's go turn these in. 
Yeah, I like unit scan a lot. I really like unit scan. I'm so glad Russell said that in the meeting. Yeah, I would have had no idea had Russell not mentioned it. That bar, are you talking about the Elv one that Yurio told you about? Oh, is it different than that? There is a weak ores version. Does it want us to be in feral ass? Yeah, all right. Oh, we can just hurt there. I'll be right back. We're in feral ass. Let's go. Um. Oh, we have this quest we could turn in too. That's the quest, right? Turn in missing courier. Where's that turned in at? Well, we're here. Might as well just turn this. Oh, oh, that's right there, huh? Yeah. I mean, might as well just turn this one in now since we're here. Oh, no, you're good. Did you respond? What did you respond to late? I didn't even notice. Didn't even notice. Very weird here. In a good, wholesome way. Okay, wait, where's the... Sh over here? 
Bam, ba damn, ba damn, bam. Oh, uh, let's sell some shit before we go anywhere. Damn, I have so much mage weave now. I need that. I need that. That's it? Oh, these? Oh, I could sell. Oh, shit. I'm going to sell these on the auction house. That's three gold right there, potentially. Then, wait, what's my first aid at? Oh, I need to go. And train my first. I need to go buy another book. I think. Where do I get heavy mage weave book from? Is that the same place in Stormguard? I thought I bought all the books I, I could from there. That place in Arthai Highlands. All right. Where's the over here? Going good, Gersov. How's it going for you? Ooh, the boat's here. Hurry. No. We're going to make it. Before Hardcore WoW, we were playing this game called Dark and Darker pretty much nonstop. And before that, it's like a new game every couple days. We do a lot of variety. But I got pretty hard stuck on Dark and Darker when that came out. And then uh, we've been doing this ever since that. Ooh, bummer. Yep, internet sucks sometimes. Internet's a bummer. I'm pretty much, I try to do a variety as much as possible, but every once in a while we get uh, just stuck on a game. And this WoW meta is the funnest meta I've ever been a part of. More like dead and deader, am I right? Yeah. Yeah, I know there's a lot of people that still like playing it, but man, even the people that are like, were the biggest like dark and darker streamers, they're all experiencing like viewer count drops, things like that. We were going to try that game Lethal Company tonight for a little bit, and we're going to play that. But uh, I don't know when. I decided I wanted to watch that OnlyFangs meeting and then get right into WoW. But uh, it might be a while before we get back to variety. But once we're done with WoW... Oh my... Oh, shit. That scared me. The Shore Strider. Once we get back, uh, or once we're done with WoW, we're going to play some Sea of Thieves. We're going to play Lethal Company. We're going to play Party Animals. Um, probably play some Dark and Darker again, maybe. I don't really have a desire to play that, though. Right now. Yeah, WoW is life now. Exactly. Exactly. Wait. Warcraft 3 Reforged? I've thought about playing StarCraft. Might, that might get added to the list. 